The cycle begins with the refrigerant entering the compressor as a low pressure, low temperature vapor. The compressor pressurizes the refrigerant and it exits as a high pressure, high temperature vapor. Next, the refrigerant moves through the condenser coil. The refrigerant flows through a filter dryer to remove any contaminants and moisture. It then enters the expansion device, which is often a thin capillary tube. As the refrigerant flows through the capillary tube, its pressure drops significantly, and it enters the evaporator section as a low pressure, low temperature liquid vapor mixture. The evaporator coil is located inside the refrigerator and the heat from the air inside is absorbed into the refrigerant. This cools the air inside the fridge. The refrigerant is boiled and evaporates, exiting the evaporator as a low pressure, low temperature vapor. It then returns to the compressor and the cycle starts.